Hey guys, today I'm going to be modifying the balcony to turn it into a greenhouse. What you're seeing here is a balcony that already has a built-in cover. To simply turn this into somewhat of a greenhouse for me, I'm just going to be screwing onto these beams. And um, yeah, hopefully that's going to do the job. I picked out these shower curtains. I went with these clear liners because they're going to allow more light through since the balcony is facing the shade. And I'm going to be using these simple shower hooks and this wooden rod. I'm going to be using two rods total to cover up this whole space. And to hold the rod, I am using the hole strap. And because the hole on the strap is kind of big, we found these washer ring things and I'm just going to be placing the screw through this and that should fill in the hole on the strap. In this project, I am so grateful that my dad is willing to help me out, so thanks dad! First, he is going to be making a hole using this tool. This is going to make it easier for the screw to go in later. So just making a hole with this tool. And you can see we're obviously not pros here, but trying to keep it, you know, this project to be as slow budget as possible to transform this space into somewhat of a greenhouse for me. And next we're using the screwdriver and going to be actually putting the screw in. And that is it. All right, we got one end done. Now we need to do the same thing to the other end. Making a hole to put the screw and the hook in so that we can anchor this rod. Now he's just going back in to tighten up all the screws and then we're going to move on to work on the other side of this balcony. Now he's going to do the same thing to the other side, which is to put the screw, the whole strap in and the rod so then we can put the shower curtain in place.
done right now. This is a pretty quick, easy, cheap modification we did to the greenhouse. And uh, I think as soon as I can get some plants in here, it should create some nice humidity, but also some airflow around the small parts on the corners here with the openings. So um, it should work out. Time to move the plants in and I'll get back. I'll get right back to you guys. It's getting a bit more cozy in here. Got some plants in. I'm going to be putting some more in here in the near future, so I'll be sure to update you guys with a new video and um, show you guys how this greenhouse is doing. Well, thank you so much for joining me on this episode, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and please like, share, and subscribe to this channel if you haven't. There's gonna be new videos coming out your way very soon, and if, you're, if you need to add more plants to your garden collection, I'd love for you to check out my website at wendyland.com. I'll leave the links below this video for you. You can also follow me on Instagram or Facebook where I share, you know, just things going on around here on social media, so. Thank you so much, you guys, and I'll see you right back here in the next video. Bye.